jump to tuck handstand on the P-bars. The jump to tuck handstand is simply another way to jump into a handstand. The same movement can be performed without the P-bars, but typically the P-bars make it easier. Start by kneeling on the floor with the knees between the hands. The arms are straight and the shoulders are slightly forward of the wrists. Push down into the ground and protract the shoulders. From here, we use the kneeling tuck press movement to lift the hips up nice and high. Always think about stacking the hips vertically above the wrists, elbows and shoulders. Now unless you have amazing flexibility, the kneeling tuck press will not get the hips as high as you will need them, but the thought of stacking them in alignment will help when you do jump into the tuck handstand. Push into the floor nice and hard is the number one focus point that will help you catch the tuck handstand balance point. You want your traps and your back muscles to be active so that you are able to catch and hold the tuck handstand. As you move through the kneeling tuck press and jump to the tuck handstand, you must think about opening the shoulders to 180 degrees of flexion. The wrists, elbows and shoulders will be in a nice straight vertical line. You must also think about pointing the toes and pulling your heels towards your butt. Try to keep the bottom rib down and depending on your flexibility how close you will be able to get your knees to your chest and hold the balance. Try to catch the tuck handstand hold for the prescribed time, and then slowly return down to the kneeling position. We want to control the eccentric as this will help to build the straight arms pulling strength that is used to pull you up in the handstand. Try to feel the lats working and try to find this tension in the kick-ups. Be aware that the power of the kick-up does not need to be too strong. Slowing it down and using just enough power to hit alignment will make finding the balance point much easier than too much power. Also try to remember to breathe in the handstand.